Hey guys, as many of you may know, my girlfriend is almost eight months pregnant. So we're not able to really travel as much as we used to. I think uh, the biggest event we did recently was Shadow Mewtwo in New York City. So we've just been collecting Weiss and we have the card cap to secure out. Some things that I learned about like collecting for fun. Uh, obviously, I'm a long term collector of Magic and Pokemon. I even owned a Pokemon Magic store for seven years. So I have quite the collection. I didn't really collect Weiss until recently, and now we're kind of doing it together. It's a fun hobby. And that's my really understanding of how to have fun in a hobby is to do it with other people. So when you do it yourself, not really that fun when you do other people. So we have the host set and we're actually getting another one from the same seller. This is eBay authenticated. We're getting another one of these from in the mail. We're getting two card captor Sakuras and one will be graded. One's, one's graded a 10, a BGS 10, one 9.5 and the other one is a raw copy that is the same. We're collecting all of them. And yeah, it's kind of interesting to collect with your girlfriend. You're going to collect different stuff. We, we did Pokemon. And she did enjoy Pokemon. Pokemon was really fun to open packs. But uh, Weiss has been quite kind of interesting. So we've opened a few cases of Weiss. And we made a massive... I guess like I didn't research it. Obviously, you, know, you think that you know a little bit more about this than you do. I didn't research it. I didn't realize how rare the SSPs are, that they're one per master case. So we kept buying Spy Family uh, cases, but you know, I, it didn't occur to me that it was something called a master case, which is two cases to get secret rares. I'm just gonna show off some cards. I can't even see that. That's probably a black hole from the thing. And uh, yeah, we just, ordered a bunch more uh, we have a lot incoming by this time we probably have a play set of i uh, it looks like we it's coming out in english and we're gonna buy a play set of that as well so here uh we, we did get another one we did pull one of them we pulled the jp so the english went on sale for only a hundred dollars those are secret rares uh we have like other stuff like jp stuff but it's um kind of fun this one was really difficult to pull uh the secret rares man it's tough uh so we have spent a lot of money on this collectible hobby and the way that i justify in my own brain i don't know if this makes sense is we're not able to do pokemon go anymore if you were to travel to new york city to do like a shadow mewtwo i actually have because of the timing, my credit card is actually exactly aligns to like when, actually I used a different credit card for that. So I wanted to see how much the tickets were. It's about $900 for plane tickets, $800 for hotel for four days, meals, entertainment. Uh, we went to see a Broadway play, just one. Uh, and it was kind of, you know, New York City. I went to NYU, it's good to see friends old friends are all doctors now <laughs> you know i was pre-med in nyu so very few you know my lawyer friends they're all they're all doctors there's very few lawyers so it's kind of nice our nurses it's nice to catch up with them so basically we've been collecting weiss uh and we've been doing jp and uh as well as na english uh, we've gone heavy on oshino co which has a second season uh, her nephew is a big fan of the singer for the song, which is different than the actress, which I found out. I thought the signature was the singer of that song, but Ado, but it actually isn't that. So we've been buying slabs and they're very cheap. If you have money right now, it's a fun collectability. So anyway, back to my idea of Pokemon Go and then passes, raid passes and so on. You're looking at 50 bucks a piece at least. We won't be able to do GoFest because we're expecting. So if she was not pregnant, we would 100% do New York GoFest right now. And the cost of New York GoFest would be uh, 800 plus 600 plus, let's call it another thousand in discretionary and restaurants. 
you're looking at about $2,800. Now, have we spent that on Weiss? Yes. Again, we're going to get another copy of this from the same buyer. So by the next time I make a video, I'll have either two copies or four copies of it. Uh, there, I bought some other copies of their team and they're in Japan right now. So they're kind of like doing customs. And uh, what the grading, not grading, I even have like CG, when I didn't know what was going on, I bought a CGS, CGC, don't love CGC. And we are just having a fun time opening boxes. So a case is about $1,800. Uh, Spy Family was actually much cheaper. Uh, or oh, two cases, a massive case is eighteen hundred dollars. Spy Family is a little bit cheaper than that. But we're just having a really fun time buying cards on eBay, buying cards, opening cards. Opening cards is not as fun, and this is kind of how you enjoy the hobby. It's not really an investment. It's just something that we can do with time together. And now that we used to go to parks, we played a lot of Pokemon Go. And we actually, our first date was playing Pokemon Go in the mall that I used to have my store in called Darebrook Mall. That was our first date was a Fennekin Day. So Pokemon Go has played a huge part in our lives so far. But obviously when you're seven months, eight months pregnant, it's probably not, you no, know, our doctor said you don't want to really travel that much. So we couldn't do the Go Fast New York. We did do Go Fest in New York last year, uh, and we did the Global in New York. So we actually double dipped, right? So we did the Go Fest in. Uh, my friend actually had a apartment that uh, he he was on vacation. I forget what time it was. He was on summer vacation or something, and he just had an apartment that we could go into, and so that was really cool and really nice of him. But for the most part, we're just kind of collecting cards now. And it's a, it's a fun hobby. So you pull these two on camera. I pulled this one on camera. Uh, we bought this from eBay. We pulled all of these. These are the, uh, <laughs> the my case of FGO I posted on YouTube. This is a really cool set. I don't really like the logos, but the Scarlet Witch is kind of cool looking. Uh, Sword Art Online. These are older ones. So I did have like somewhat of a Weiss collection, but not nearly as expensive as today. Next time I talk about Weiss, I'll probably have, uh, I'll make another video about collecting with your girlfriend or significant other and how that's different than collecting by yourself. Um, every major decision we made in terms of like what cases to buy. If you have a hookup on Oshinoko cases, we'll probably, English, when it comes out, we'll probably buy whatever you have. We're going to try to make a playset of both the Japanese and English. We actually have a playset. Assuming there's one auction, left. so there are. We're getting two more in the mail. I'm getting one more on Monday, the the Monday. So it's like two days from now, and we're getting another one in the mail. It's, it's coming from Japan, and then we're getting another one auction ends tomorrow, and we're probably going to win that auction, and we're getting a BGS. So I'm going to get a whole BGS set. And they're also a raw playset of them. So we can make uh, two decks, one in English, one in Japanese. Yeah. Anyway, hi guys.